Hello and welcome. My name is Ajax Post and that train is off in the distance. Good, carrying very few planks. Whereas our little train here is carrying quite a few logs. And I may actually need to make that train a bit bigger because it has left quite a few behind. Hi, yes, we're in Transport Fever 2 and we are just a few months on from where we left off at the last uh, episode. So these new lines are taking logs to planks to planks to tools. Um, they're not making any money yet, but we're about to change that because hopefully if I start adding in some destinations, some consumers for these tools, then that should uh, spark demand for planks. And if people want planks, then people will want logs. Uh, hopefully, yeah. Although this forest here, Midsummer Norton, is uh, doing quite well. It's uh, shipping a lot of its maximum production. This little forest, uh, that's the wrong one. Where's the other little forest? This one, I've, oh, there it is, there it is. Yeah, this one here in Shepton Mallet. Yeah, it's not shipping a lot. I mean, that's a little truck route. That should be able to pick up. But I think we need to increase our shipment of tools to do that. Now, I was looking at this before I clicked on the record button. And we've got two towns near-ish which require tools. We've got Trowbridge up here. And we have Froome. I, I understand some people say Frome. Yeah, I don't know why, but yeah, I, I'm going to say Froome. Uh, if you find that difficult to to, to take, to uh, to understand or to um, accept, then I apologise. But yeah, that's that's just who I am. So we got Froome here, and I was thinking of having truck routes, a nice big truck distribution depot here, shipping out to these two towns. But then I thought, well, actually, Froome is a bit of a distance, and the actual demand for tools, if we go into our cargo layer here, is actually quite close to the passenger station. In fact, everything. <laughs> it is really clustered around that, isn't it? Yeah, I've, I suspect this is to do with the pollutions layer. Oh, wow, that, that's jolly interesting, isn't it? The pollution is really heavy around here, which is where all the residential buildings are. Oh, and less heavy. Now, this is that's that's counterintuitive. I really was not expecting that. I was expecting these colours to be reversed, ignoring the emissions issue, which I've just <laughs> the game has again proved me wrong. So I was thinking we'll have a train going there actually to Froome. And what we'll do is we'll configure our little station here to take both passengers and cargo. I'm just looking at the track coming in here, is this going to be sensible actually? So where, where the heck are you coming from? You're coming from here. You could actually, yeah, you could run along the passenger route here. And I could have you going through the middle of Warminster Station. That'd be neat, wouldn't it? I like doing that. And out here to Froome. I think I've got enough room here to separate the tracks out. Okay, we'll try this. See how well this works. Uh, so we're going to need passenger station, uh, passenger platforms. You'll be down here somewhere, right at the end. Uh, yeah, we've only got, I think we've only got one type of cargo platform, haven't we? It's not something that modders spend a lot of time on, it's cargo stations particularly, which is a bit of a shame, but you know, that that's the way of it. So, and tracks will make this high speed, of course. Not that it needs to be when you're coming to a full stop in a station. That's 160, I think, isn't it? So, actually, just double check that. <laughs> uh, yes, 160. I don't think these trains will need to be that long. Right, what's going on here? Let's uh, we'll get rid of you for a second. Uh, let's get, uh, get rid of that crossover there. Yeah, it's going to cause me problems, but we'll deal with that in a second. Track. Uh, did I have catenary on that? No, thank goodness for that. Uh, no catenary. And... Mm, let's get rid of that signal, because you'll probably be in the way as well. Right, so how are we going to get this track? No, not that. This track from here. Can you get from here? To that you can. It's a little bit slow. Or do we want them to come in separately through the tunnel? I think that might be a better thing to do, actually. Yeah, have them coming in separately through the tunnel. 
So they will we'll use the same track over the bridge. That's fine. And then we'll separate out through the tunnel. Now if I draw you to there. Yep, yeah, that's okay. Uh, that's... Oh, bother. <laughs> that's... That was standard track, which we don't want. We want... Yeah, that's it. Okay, there you are. Can I get you across... There you are. Quite slow, though. Ooh, you're getting faster. If we get rid of this signal... In fact, get rid of both these signals. Oh, and the track. Yeah, clumsy cloof. Clumsy oaf. There we go. Put that back. Let's get this. Can we get that to even faster than 61 something miles an hour? Ooh, 70. I'll take that. Yeah, that's cool. And we'll bring you out along here as well. Get you through the tunnel. So all the way along here. Through here. Okay. Yeah, that's looking good. And if I get you across the crossing there, so it's one road crossing rather than two. Not that there's much traffic going that way anyway, so that shouldn't be a big issue. Uh, if I, uh, uh, have I actually connected that? No. There we go. Bring you along here. Can I? Ooh, I like that. I like that. Yeah. That's good. I like that. I think, yep, that works for me. Uh, in fact, so we didn't need to get rid of this cross over here, did we? <laughs> hey ho. You know, you live and learn. You try things out. That's the thing, isn't it? And up there. Yep, so that exclamation is gone. Uh, do we want some... Ooh. What's going on here? Ooh, goodness me, no. What? Why? 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 Ugh, no. I, that, <laughs> it'll be fun if you're riding over that, but if you're in a... Oh, dear. Okay, we'll get rid of you. Oh, we'll have to get rid of you as well, won't we? Okay. Can I draw that down? So what type of road is that? That's a city street. And, okay. Which type are you? Ah, you're that type. Okay. Let me draw you down like that. Oh, it's... Okay. What if we take all this track up and try that again? See if we can actually get even track, because that would be nice. I, I mean, I'm not overly concerned about road passengers here, because my, my vehicles, I don't think, are using that route. But it would be nice, I think, if we could have a reasonably simple and straightforward road crossing. And you, you're coming up. Uh, is that going to be part of the issue? fact that we've got that there. Mm. I think it does still look a little bit slopey, doesn't it? That's part of the problem. Uh, where's that? Okay. If I drag that out to there. So those tracks are basically abutting each other appropriately. Okay, and can we do this? That's much nicer. Excellent. Right, we're happy with that. <laughs> Deary me. Okay, we were looking for some signals which we missed out then, weren't we? So imagine these are going to be one-way signals. Uh, going in there. 
coming out here. We'll put you... No, we'll put you there. I think that's reasonable. And coming in on the cargo side, I'm going to want you about there. That looks good. Okay. Now, how far does that... Well, that covers a reasonable amount, actually. Can I get it to show me... It overlays it with the wrong colour. If I put in a road stop, does that show me what I'm looking for here? I'm going to need more, I think, aren't I? I'm going to need a road crossing there. Which actually, we can do that. So we're going to need... We could actually have the cargo coming out of this site, because it doesn't matter. Cargo will transfer across the station, even across passenger platforms. We could put that in there. What are my bus routes doing? You go down there. That's all right. But I was thinking we could have it coming up this side. Let's... Um, are we get likely to have any goods coming in from this side of Froome? It does really look as goods, but they'll mm, they might they could come in through, but we don't want goods there anyway. I think we're okay. I think yeah. If I put another platform on there, uh, platforms. There we go. Another little cargo one. Ooh, or could I? Actually, no. Cargo buildings. Can I put you there? Uh, yeah, you, yeah I, I hate the way it does that. It cuts across. Oh, I wonder, actually, can I stop it doing that by putting in, in a little bit of dummy track? Like so. Actually, can I... Mm, I want you to... That's it. I think that's... That's snapping appropriately, isn't it? So if I put you in there, for no other reason than I just want to put some track in there. Oh, it still does it! Oh, for goodness sakes, it cuts across the standard track as well. I was hoping it wouldn't do that. Oh, that's annoying. That is very annoying. Oh. Okay. Right. I'll put you in Actually, we could put you there, couldn't we? And then if I put the building in here, a little bit like that, yeah. And another little building alongside it, that is sweet. And then I can have roads going across this tunnel so they don't intersect with the track at all which is what I was after actually this could be country road could it be country road no no we'll keep it uh, city street I think uh, I'll keep it you don't want trees no and will I own it yes I'll own this bit I think no I won't I was thinking would it be useful to stop the city developing along here and I don't see any reason for that to be honest, so I'll take you like so. Okay, splendid. Uh, where the heck it? What? Uh, there you go. That's better. And if I take you around like so, that's an expensive bit of road, mind, but you know it does the trick. Now, where do we want that cargo stop? Uh, we'll use a simple drop-off point here. And, okay, so we are covering the, the top of the town there. It's all over here, isn't it? I think... Mm, somewhere in here. Actually, how fast is that road? Is that slow road? That is very slow road. I don't want that slow road in there. I'm going to make something a bit faster. Okay. 
I don't want any slow road down here. Nope, that's good. I'm happy with that. Uh, so we can put you in here. And you cover oh, a nice chunk of the town. That's... Uh, are, are you intersecting a, a lamp post? I noticed I put some bus stops down previously, off camera, before before I did the uh, the previous recording. And they were sat right on top of a lamp post, which was just looked st stupid, really. <laughs> okay, so I will get rid of you. Put you there so you line up with that one. That's lovely. Okay, and oh, we're going to need a truck stop, aren't we, to actually get stuff out of here. What are these like? Small city? These are nice, but they, they don't do um, upgrades though, uh, which is slightly frustrating, but they do look good. Actually, I'm wondering what their capacity will be. They probably don't need to be too big. If in doubt, I can always... Do I want it? No, I want... Oh, auto saving. We'll be back in a second. Can we put... Oh, we can connect you. Ooh, that looks good. It connects directly into... It connects directly into the, the train station. The cargo platform. Oh, that looks good. I like that. Yeah, definitely. Uh, Froome Branch, whatever. Um, actually, I want to rename... Yeah, this one. So this is Froom Froom Freight, so that I know that I'm going to the right station, as opposed to Froom the passenger station. Uh, we'll tidy some of this up a bit. We'll do this a bit more off camera, just to smooth all this out to make it look a little bit prettier. There we go. That's nice. Uh, so we're going to want a route. Uh, no, that's not routing. A new line from there. We'll use, uh, this is going to be tools, isn't it? So it could be a sort of grey colour. To there. Um, no, I want you to go the other direction. That's better. That way you're not sort of sitting behind or in front of uh, a bus. Yeah, so you're not interfering with each other. That is splendid. We'll do that and we're going to be calling you Froome Local Delivery. Excellent. And we have a oh we have a depot there, so we'll get that out of the way in a minute. We need to complete this train route though, <laughs> from from the tool station uh, to Froome. So I was thinking we could, yeah, enhance Warminster here. Oh dear, yeah, there's a lot of three hundred ten. Not quite sure. Uh, uh, yeah, maybe when I broke the route earlier, that's what it does. Yeah, okay. Um, mm. We're going to need to... Ex okay. <laughs> this uh, we'll, we'll probably lose some passengers along the way, but that, that unfortunately is the way of the thing. Um, so I've got the brown G old GWR. Have we got a new platform we could use? The thing is, I think these... Oh, no, no, you're okay. You are Network Southeast, I think. What are you? Oh, you're a new, you're a different one. Okay, what do you look like? Sit there. Oh, no, they are different heights. Yeah, you can see that. Yeah, I, yeah I'm going to stick with the same height, I'm afraid. So we don't want you. I don't particularly want mm, things you've got. All those seats. What about you? Are you vanilla height as well? You are. Okay. But yeah, right. You're the wrong era. Let's. Uh, I want to delete you. Yeah. What about you? Okay. Well, you'll, you'll do, I suppose. <laughs> Though we do have. Uh, the thing is, Mad Hatter does like to go for authenticity, so I think a lot of these, yeah, they're going to be proper height, as it were. They're not going to concede defeat to the vanilla height of platforms. 
I think all these will be much the same, won't they? What's that? That's a platform. Yeah, again, you're too high, I'm afraid. Sorry. Alright, so what we'll do, we'll put in the standard one. Uh, this is along here. We'll put in the standard platform for the centre point. Or the centre rows. Yeah, and the empty ones at the end. There we go. And some canopy. I've done this slightly wrong. Okay, we'll we'll fix this. Put you there and there. Okay. Uh, get rid of you, 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 and you. Put the empty one in at the end. There we go. Some track, a little bit of high speed. You can come along here. We will remove you. Oh, no, I can't remove you yet. Okay, that's that done. And remove you and you. And just put in some straightforward transit track straight through the middle. Like so. Actually, can you? That's a bit slow. We'll work on that in a second. It looked almost as if that was curving. I'm sure it's not. Uh, I'll take you back. And you. I think. Yeah. Connect you to there. You to there. And likewise over here. Splendid. And then we can take you from there to there. That's a sound speed. I'm happy with that. And to there. Well, it's a bit slower. Oh, you're inside of the curve there, aren't you? That's why. Can we make you a little bit faster? A little bit faster. Okay, we don't have curve issues here, so we should be all right. That'll do. That will do. Okay. And the signals here will be coming out of the platform. Uh, you're one way, yep. In that direction. And in that direction. So we're going to give the through trains, which are in fact the freight trains here, um, precedence over our over our passenger service. Okay. Uh, do we want more signals along here? We could probably do with a couple, to be honest. Uh, so we'll put you there and there. The other side should be all right, I think. Uh, this needs to be sorted out. Um, okay, actually, what we'll do, what's the line look like? Manage the line. So you're coming back uh, from Warminster. You're going to be on platform number two. Super. Right, that works again. So we've now got... Actually, we could probably do with... Yeah, a couple more signals here. I think we'll have some off and on the bridge. Okay. And here... So the freight service will give way to the passenger coming in. Uh, where's the... Okay, what have we got there? You're going... Actually, you're all right there, aren't you? That's fine. And again, here. I think that will be all right. 
I think. Okay, so we've got that. So we just now need to connect the track up here. Let's get rid of that road. And we'll come out of here. Where are we going to go? We're going to connect somewhere over. Oof. Really? Don't be ridiculous. <laughs> okay. If we can we connect it from here? Will you connect to there? You will, but I think we'll take that. Yeah, we'll take that down so we get slightly better speeds coming out of there, I think. We come round to there. That's better, I think. Then we can more or less go straight across there. Does that seem reasonable to you? I think so. And then we can cut right in there on that. Okay, we'll go there. What do you mean? No, don't do do don't do that. Why is that? S no, don't be so slow. It's very odd. It's a little slower than I would like, to be honest. So what if we take that road out? To start with, okay. We'll put something back in in a minute. Don't worry too much. Oh, that's much healthier. A good hundred plus. Splendid. We'll come out from there. That's good. That's fine from me. A little bit of the old signalling. Uh, yeah, you're going to wait there. Okay, yeah, the passenger route will have precedence, I think, uh, going in there. Do we need to worry about that? No, but we will be going back that way. So we will give them from there. That looks cool. And we'll put some... I put them on the wrong way, you great plonker. Right, bear with me a second. I'll get rid of all these erroneous signals. Right, we'll try that again and do it properly, shall we, this time? There you go, on the outside of the track. There you go. That's better. Hang on, what? <laughs> That's truth. Oh dear. Okay, what can you do with someone who's so clearly incapable of drawing lines which come together? Right, we'll try that again, shall we? And we'll have the track connecting, like so. And there, that is good. Right, and we'll do some more signalling. From there. That's altogether better. Splendid. And we'll have some going in the other direction. That's good. Okay, we'll sort out the switches we need and so on in a moment, but I think that should be all right. Presumably, Shepton Mallet Planks is coming in on platform one, which is the one closest to the factory. So we just need a little bit of track coming in a bit like that. Yeah, we'll do 60 mile an hour there I think is acceptable yeah and we'll have a signal do we want any more signals here uh, 
Possibly not, actually. Now we could have one, yeah, just beyond the switch. We'll put one there for clearance purposes. That will do. And our new line, which will make a slightly darker grey for the tools coming from there. Westbury tools into Froom Freight. That's you. And you are working very nicely indeed. And are you going through? You are going through the centre of Westbury Station, uh, Warminster Station, rather. Excellent. We'll call you Froom Tools Bulk. That will be joyous. And we want a train. Oh, we're going to get a train there. <laughs> uh, where's? Oh. oh, actually, no, we can. This, this, yeah, this depot here could get a train onto that line. Yeah, we should be able to navigate through to Froome. Okay, excellent. And okay, again, we're looking for diesel. It doesn't need to be terribly fast. The 90 is quite nice, actually. That's not a bad combination of power and speed. You're a bit faster, more powerful. You're faster. You're, ooh, you're slower but more powerful. I'm not sure how much these things weigh. That's the <laughs> part of my issue here. 59. No you're, no, you're nice and cheap, but you're not terribly powerful. We'll tr we'll try this, shall we? See if how many wagons this will take before it gets under under power becomes underpowered. So this is going to be tools. And we're carrying, going at 80 miles an hour. We don't need anything that goes quite that fast. Because all these wagons now are really... You're 75, you're the naffy. 99, you're just 75. You carry 13. The naffy carries 14. Do you know what? I'm going to go with the naffy. 1, 2, 3, 4... That's probably more, that's, well, let's see how many we need. We can always expand this and change this vehicle, can't we, later. So that's not a problem. So we'll put you on there. And can you go now to a Froome route? Yes, you can. Lovely. And our wagons, our, tra our buses, our buses, our buses, our buses, our trucks, <laughs> I mean... From here, uh, we'll only put a couple on to start with, I think. Uh, tools. Uh, yeah, you're you're good. You're actually you're quite good and cost effective. The DAF is is I like the I like these DAF wagons, but. They, they go faster than they really need to, in, certainly within a city. Uh, and we probably don't need to... Uh, we'll, we'll go for... Yeah, the Isuzu. I think, yeah. I will just put a couple on there for the moment. Okay, right, we'll set that in motion. And I'll come back to that in a moment. Now, one other thing... Now, over here, we've got a, a reasonably successful oil-to-fuel system here taking oil from the wells oil well i'm sure there is no such beast in reality uh, to the refinery here to the fuel and that sends fuel to both burnham i think uh, does it oh no it sends fuel back to wells that's right on the train yeah you can see it going back there and also a small train going into western but we've got these towns here as well, Burnham on Sea and Breen that need fuel. And I was thinking what would be might work better is have a tr a, ma a truck distribution centre here to do all this, uh, and actually replace a number of the trains, including this one here, because we do have now quite capable trucks which can carry f large amounts of oil at a good speed. So that's what we're going to do next, I think. set up our network here and what I'm thinking is 
And we'll use one of these. We'll use one of these, I think. I mean, I like this because it has various fence types around it and you can make it longer and wider but you can't configure it within that they are just plain platforms whereas at least on the more standard one you can put in different cargo platforms as it were including as we've seen elsewhere uh, those oil um, pipes things <laughs> so, yes yeah, so we'll put you in there uh, how many platforms we want here we're going to have Oh, actually coming in here is going to be two. Yeah, one in and one out. That's fine. So we're going to want... Can we put another entrance in straight away? No, we can't. Gravel B, 20. That will do for the moment. Get you lined up like so. And then I can configure you. Uh, we'll take that off to start with. And right, they're all they're whole platforms. Okay, so here we can put our pipe work in, and you're picking up from the right, so it'll be along here, won't it? Or no, no, just have one there, and on this one, this will be going out to the fuel refinery out here somewhere so this will have more stacked up on it actually what we could do we could put a a little is there a proper building here there isn't really 1850 1960 and we'll put you there then okay and then we can have our oh i picked the wrong one there haven't i that should be the pipe one that's better and then, okay, we'll do this again properly. Okay, we want the pipes, the pipes, the pipes they are calling. Uh, we'll have a standard bit of platform there. And then our little shack for the man running the place. Or the team of distribution experts. That can go there. And we want some roads in and out. And we will use, yeah, no, we'll do it, we will do it like that. We will do it like that, that's fine. And some streets, this will be country road. It'll be reasonably 60. And the trouble is, to, to make it faster, you need really wide roads, and I don't want really wide roads. Okay, fair enough. Right, and you are going to go up here here yes so we'll send you there to there and we do already have a truck stop up here but this is for delivering the fuel into wells the fuel that comes back so we're going to need to improve this stop here which is already overflowing that's on the wrong orientation isn't it can i how many platforms can i add to this i can't go there because uh, yeah i can go there and i can do why is what's that colliding with that bit of road Let's get the road out of the way. No, it's that I want to do. Oh, it's changing the shape of the... Mm, bother. Okay. Do it that way. Do I need another one here? Yeah. We'll put a standard one there. A little office there. One of those again. Okay, let's put that road back in. Uh, which road was it? That one? That one. Okay, and uh, we want uh, another. Actually, what we'll do, we'll get rid of that. And we'll put in that there. And 
that there. Okay, bring our road up. Uh, not that one. That one. What we'll do is have you coming across here to go around so we can have some sort of simple one-way system. In fact, what I could do... That looks really awful, doesn't it? It looks... I might tidy that up because that still looks really naff, doesn't it? So what routes do we have here? We have you doing that. What I'd like you to do is come in from the other end. So I want it to be a one-way system through this uh, through this stop, through this station. I'm going to have to wait for the autosave to finish. Uh, okay. Right, so that's done. We've got our little waypoint there, so I can now f oops, fiddle with this line so that it comes from after that I want it to go there that's good okay I'm happy enough with that uh, so we've got oh I didn't realize I put a tunnel in there oh well <laughs> so we're going to have uh, fuel delivered from crude oil delivered from there and then have, we're going to have a similar roundabout one-way system operating through here as well. We'll send that off to wherever it needs to go for the time being. Actually, if I put you uh, across there, like so, bring you down like that. off the ends. Okay, cool. So we're going to have a new line. We'll give this one that nice yellow colour. From there to there. Okay. Platform two, I think. Yes. And from there... We need a, a waypoint on the other side of the road. Like so. So from Burnham on C, you're going to go there. That works well. I'm okay with that. And we'll call you Wells Crude Bulk. Okay, splendid. Uh, that train is full, so okay. Yeah, we'll let you do your job. But what I want to do is get a lot of oil tankers out of here. Crude oil. Uh, crude oil. There you are. And we have got these really nice Scanyas and man trucks, which take 32, which is a nice number. Um, I think that's pretty much the largest capacity of these tankers. The man's... Oh, they take 42. But they only go 56 miles an hour. Whereas these go 75, which actually is faster than our roads, isn't it? So maybe the man is a better choice. Could be, actually, yeah. 42, slightly slower, but that's okay. Or 62. That's 30, though. You're 145. You're 19. Uh, let's, let's take these mans, okay? Or MANs, whichever. Uh, we'll put 6 on there. Which is kind of the capacity of the train, possibly, nearly. I'm not adding the numbers up. So put you on there, and you can go on the crude bulk. There we go. And what I'll do as well is I will replace the train taking the crude, the, the refined oil here to the fuel refinery, and also into Wells, I'll ch into Western rather, I'll change that. So we'll have a nice sort of hub 
for road distribution from here, I think. Yeah, from, from Burnham-on-Sea. Okay, so that's running off. Uh, that will settle down and uh, I may, sh may show you the workings of uh, that uh, rewrite of the route in the next episode. Or uh, I may just uh, speed build it and come back to it completed in the next episode. Anyway, I'll leave that to settle in for a moment. Let's go back to our tools and planks and things. Uh, where's that train? Going to Froome. Where is Froome? There's Froome. Where's the train? Is there a train? Where, where is that other train? Come on. Come on. We had... Room tools bulk, that train there, where the heck are you? Oh, there you are! Splendid! Right, uh, yeah. Let's just uh, follow you through here, I think. That's quite nice, and you should. This is, yeah, approaching Warminster. There's a passenger train going out of the way. So that's it, I think, for me for this episode of Transport Fever 2. I hope you've enjoyed this. If you have, it'd be great to hear from you. A little bit of a like would be lovely. Just click on the old thumbs up button. Even better, though, if you've got any thoughts about what I'm doing with the game or the game itself, please do drop a note into the comments box below. That would be awesome. Other than that, of course, if you've not already subscribed to the channel, then you could do that now. This station could do with a canopy. <laughs> Uh, yeah, if you've not already subscribed, you could do that now, and that way you'll know when I upload another one of these, or any of my other Let's Play series. But from me, Ajax Post, here in Transport Fever 2, until the next time, bye-bye for now.